what's up welcome and welcome back to my channel i'm your girl chanel the living Dolly, and welcome to my weekly vlog number five hope you enjoy don't forget to subscribe so we're starting off today i did not do anything much today so naya made us some tacos and i am so extremely happy because y'all we haven't had tacos in a while i really don't know why but they were absolutely delish we are now at Tuesday and we're heading to do one of my favorite things ever, which is to go pick up packages at WebSource. So I do have a Shein haul coming for y'all this week. Stay tuned on my Instagram stories as well as on my YouTube and you will see whether it's going to be Wednesday or Friday, right? These are the packages here. This package is actually a lot of nice stuff mainly for her birthday if you all don't know Naya turned 17 next friday the 16th so she actually purchased this camera case and then from she and my dad and then i got me some hash browns for dinner keeping it nice and chill but yeah still stay, stay tuned sorry for her birthday vlog it's gonna be really good and really fun i'm so excited and can't wait to show you all what's going on so the following day my co-worker's sister actually had a chinese queue and you all i have to say this is the best food that i've literally had in my life or in like so long it tasted so great i had like pepper shrimp and even pork oh it was good and then when I got home, it's time for me to get back on my Zoom. So now I am going to post some pictures and some videos from my business to BC Thrift Closet. If y'all are not familiar, get familiar on Instagram. So I posted this sweater vest. And then Naya made us pizzas for dinner. These thin crust pizzas. I think it's from Quesadilla Wraps. Yeah. Hey guys, what's up? Panoxyl on my face. They always say to leave it a little bit to just sink in your skin and really do its magic so if you're new here and never saw this on my face what's up welcome so out of nowhere i have this random pimple like coming up at the side and i also have one in my chin but it's under the skin i think if i was not using panoxyl it would definitely be above ground by now but anyway so i'm just trying to you know i don't know what is going on with my hormones because you all know they say any kind of breakouts along your jawline is hormonal rolls eyes anyway y'all today has been one hell of a day a lot's been happening we are officially 15 days away from Naya's birthday so y'all know the girl is always gonna come through for Naya we have so many plans and I'm just trying to organize also I'm trying to stay on top of my business as y'all can see my mannequin in back there my half mannequin so I was like I'm honestly trying to it's like a combination of both I'm doing like a closet clean out right and I'm also I'm being realistic with myself like some of these clothes like honestly you know you're just holding on to them but are you actually gonna wear them probably not because I don't really go nowhere right um so it's like closet clean out slash like life clean out <laughs> and of course make our money honey you know how we do okay sorry that was a little loud but yeah i am just trying to get some things organized when i so she can have a really great birthday we already have i can't say too much because some of y'all look at my videos and y'all might go back and tell her right so things are in the works for her some surprises that i know she's gonna love like I just want to make her 17th birthday special honestly she told me she would have liked to travel for her birthday but now is not a good time because she is in the middle of this sorry the beginning of the semester yeah because school only started back for her like two weeks ago i think this is the third week two weeks uh, yeah something like that two weeks ago so now is not the best time and last year if you'll remember she did go to panama 
you know, where we went to Panama as a family and that was kind of in the middle of the semester. So I don't really want to do that kind of thing. I really want her to push, work towards succeeding in her studies. So now's not a good time, but will we travel throughout the year and take her somewhere with us? Definitely. And then later in the month is my sister's birthday, February 28th. I know, right? She like almost wasn't born. But yeah, she, of course, you'll know. That's all I'm gonna say. But yeah, <laughs> we have some plans for her as well. So uh, my head has just been all over. I really, 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 really want to get to film this she in haul for you. I am praying I could get to film it tomorrow and post it on Saturday. If not, I'm gonna post it on Saturday and film it on Saturday. But I'm getting that she in haul out this weekend for you because my week has been so crazy i have not been able to really film videos there's a lot going on i always say this and i know i probably sound like a broken record but there's a lot going on can't say a lot right now so i'm just ugh, when i can i will but you all will see when that that great day comes when i post that video you all will be like oh so that's what's happening right but yeah in time so yeah but definitely if you're looking at this right now the sheen hall has been posted and i even playing those games i'm gonna try to make it quick and you know i have some cute stuff i want to show you all so yeah <sighs> so i'm just doing a little bit of my skincare right now the braids are still there they're looking well i think it's just my baby here a little bit that is looking a little bit rough i have not been putting anything on my edges like because i feel like when i start to do that immediately the hair starts to look a little bit more harmful but i think tomorrow please go on i'm gonna do a little edgy a little whoopty swoop not like i know what it is i'm doing but yeah we're just gonna do something a little something am i over the braids not yet but have I already started to plan my next hairstyle? Hell yeah, you know me. <laughs> so yeah, and I can't wait to show y'all. I can't wait to tell you all so many things that have been going on in my mind as well. Like, And then hold on a second. As I just see my nails, shout out to Heavenly Lush. Like I did these nails December 23rd. Yes, they have outgrown. However, not a single nail has broken. Nothing. Don't jinx me, but nothing has been broken. That girl is amazing. Go check her out, Heavenly Lush, on Instagram or even TikTok. She's very active. Speaking about active, I have not been active. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, I cannot wait till I can do what I want to do. And that day will come. Yeah. All right, cool. So I'll check in again real soon. Bye, guys guys i don't know about you but i honestly find like the days are flying it's friday already it's crazy am i happy hell yes so yes i am back again once again a little selfless promo no shame for my thrift store every day i be updating so now we are heading down at saturday heading down to central to go check out some stuff so come along with us and enjoy the vibe i love road trips by the way Surprise, you call me after the things I said. It's the 
so we are actually heading to two places carpet what is it carpet 2001 and then tile warehouse tile warehouse is honestly one of our favorite places like we're kind of obsessed with our place but yeah we're going to carpet 2001 in shogunas first to check out some stuff so let's go see what's going on so first of all i saw this carpet and i really thought it was beautiful maybe not for a bedroom but i do like it but they have such a wide selection like my family and i love to do like household shopping yeah and you all know i'm in the midst of doing a whole like revamp of my room and stuff so every weekend we be looking and checking to see what it is we like the prices were not terrible these were i think like between 1500 to like 2500 so they did have some good stuff and now they actually have one part of it that is just like for rugs and the other part in the back which i did not know it was split up into two is actually for carpet so after that we are now heading to tile warehouse we're heading to limehead road Coover. y'all i don't know what it is but literally every saturday has all of the traffic in the entire universe it is insane like where are people going i mean i'm saying this as i'm in a vehicle heading somewhere but i mean geez so if you all look closely you all can see behind this bush that the highway is like full i know they're doing like roadworks on the highway but geez it's like so much traffic everywhere in central into like the southland anyway we're finally here to limehead road and we're heading to tile warehouse they always have some of the best tiles the best appliances like i am oh i'm so glad and just in case you're living in the east like myself like their things are way more affordable i don't know what it is in the east but everything is ridiculously priced over expensive it just is not the vibe so definitely if you're looking to do any kind of remodeling any kind of you know adjustments or renovations to your house or your room or bathroom whatever it is head to central and the southland like honestly the east is just ridiculously overpriced if i sound a little bit bitter just know that yes i am upset about it because it's like crazy oh i don't know we got some really great tiles like since last year we have been kind of collecting you know different things for like our whole renovation process but it's crazy it don't make any sense so yeah tile warehouse is located in limehead road Coover, freeport if anyone is interested the customer service is pretty good they have a wide selection and yeah you're going to be impressed because they got some good stuff so let's go so check out my mommy my mommy's all here super cute dressed up so we're trying to figure out which tiles for naya so just look at the selection that they have i didn't do a full run through but they have a wide selection so next we are going over to price no sorry pennywise plaza i go in pennywise plaza because i have to get a couple things in pennywise y'all i am so sorry if i'm not the girl that does pennywise hauls anymore like mm i apologize sorry not sorry because pennywise is that kind of store that makes you want to spend out your entire life and i refuse to be broke all right so i'm definitely not doing it i literally only go to pennywise to buy refills of anything that i'm out of i'm not doing no random haul splurging like there's so many things that i'm working on in this life that mm -mm, that's just not it and yes please look at the amount of traffic on the highway like what is happening Anyway, Pennywise Plaza was like buzzing. If y'all can look, the car park is full to the brim. Like I almost thought we had to park outside because the whole nation was here. I was like, what is happening here? Like people are outside, you know, even if they're not participating in carnival events like myself, they're outside. So yeah, Pennywise Plaza it is. So I realized this couple years ago, I think it was during the pandemic, like right kind of in the middle of, I would say like 2021 that somehow this Pennywise got things cheaper. Hey guys, please send my mother money so we can afford <laughs> This is all we came for. This is all we came for. This is rosemary oil. That's so good. Like, I'm not going to say you got money, honey. No, baby. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm going to let you all in on a little secret. Your girl is seriously considering straightening her hair 
I think the natural vibe is fun, but y'all, I am kind of over it. Like, I've been natural since 2018, but I don't know. I'm trying to think about it. And then we're trying to help my sister choose which of these products to get because her hair is superbly thick, if y'all have seen, you know. But her hair is, like, crazy thick, so I don't know. I'm not a natural hair girly like that. I barely use any products. My hair is almost always in protective styling, for example, these braids, so I have no idea. But she did go with the Shea Moisture. Anyway, so yeah, something carnival-esque was happening across in Bryce Plaza. As you can see, the Midnight Rubber. I think there were some people in some stilts as well. Of course, you'll know Naya. She initially wanted to get boba, but then she decided to go get Popeyes. Something about this Popeyes here in Bryce Plaza smells so funny. Like, literally, it smells like a hot fart. Like, I could not... I was like surprised. I'm like, now you're really getting food from here, but mm -mm. give me the other one any day. And you know what I mean by the other one, right, Fallon? <laughs> we definitely been Popeye's entrance city. So yeah, we got back home and all I wanted to do was just relax and watch me some Law and Order SVU. We started to look at this series from the beginning. Y'all, I'm telling you, if you want something to binge watch, definitely start with svu or any show that you really love i know people love Grey's anatomy chicago pd i'm just calling things that you know i like as well but yeah definitely start from the beginning of the series like i love watching the characters and you know all their storylines like this is just fun for me i i'm enjoying it like literally every evening when i get home that's all i'll be doing making sure i'm watching some movies and some series mainly svu but it has been going really really good all right, so check it out. So it is now Sunday, and I woke up with a very strange headache. So I'm just like, listen, I'm not much of a tea girl, but we're going to get some tea today. And today is actually my mother's uncle's 83rd birthday. He is in the Southland. So yeah, we're going on a little bit of a road trip in our favorite rocket ship. I don't know much about South, but South is like a whole different place for me. Every time I go to South, I always say that because it is just so different when i say different like it's the people are so nice and friendly and i love the buildings like everything is just cool like i know the west because i went to school in the west like for five years the east you know is cool that's where i live but like southland is just different kind of vibes and i really do enjoy it you know so yeah let's go have some fun <laughs> Southland. I'm so excited. Y'all know I don't go nowhere. So anywhere that I get to go, we outside. Period. So this is going to be lunch for the day. A little bit of Sunday lunch. I actually did have that rotisserie chicken. Right? Wait. 
Right, there we go. I hope you're not getting us. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that look nice. This. This? Yeah. Okay, good, because you can see there the we go. Y'all check out this cute pic now I took of me in the garden <laughs> with her um what's it called in stacks camera and sun camera or whatever we all pretty much took one of course you know here's my sister showing off hers as well but it was honestly a real cool vibe it's so hot to be uh, no. ready, <laughs> you for the sun yes grindy cheese you can't make it this i am got him where's uncle what's up with your uncle okay guys so thank you so much for checking out my vlog if you all are interested this outfit is from no fashion style and i'm gonna see you in my next one bye guys <laughs>